Shrugs him off. Luke Hawks off the top with the crossbody. Hawks hits the leg one. Do we got a new champion? No. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome once again to the West Coast Wrestling Connection. I am Blake Chadwick, now joined by Brian Zane, my brand new color commentator. Brian, welcome to the WCWC. Hi. Well scouted there by the Fit Club. Folks, we have to go to commercial break when we come back. More tag team open challenge action. What? They have no right to this. Caleb Conley lost the match fair and square, and that's what happened. As the tide has certainly swung right back the other way, Bell officially sounds we are underway. Senior official Brian Hebner signed to this contest. Blockbuster tag team main event featuring the Wrecking Crew against Caleb Conley and Hammerstone. Give and go right there. Goes right back up with it off the mark. Okay. Tipped around. Nice save attempt by Dwight Holmes, but into the hands of the South Florida Gold. Kenny Holmes, he tries to go baseline, finds the cross-court pass. In the hands of Chris Cromarty for three. Kaboom! And Chris Cromarty knocks it in from way downtown. The first three-pointer of the game for the gold, and the lead now extended to 10. Look at this trapping defense here by the gold. Kenny Holmes, what a gift to Chris Cromarty. Back to Taven Cummings for the three-point play. Throw that on the highlight reel. And to the ring out here for the official. gentlemen, live. From the Karen Royale Resort in Orlando, Florida, in association with MTK, Global Boxing, Snack Nutrition, Havoc, Athletics and Enterprises, ISI, and everyone watching worldwide on IFL TV. Get ready. It's main event time. This bout will be set in the super bantamweight division with eight rounds of action. Introducing first, she is fighting out of the blue corner. She stands at five feet, four inches tall, wearing the gold trunks with the white trim. She weighed in at 121.2 pounds. She enters this fight with a record of three wins and zero losses, two of those wins by way of knockout, she is the NABF Super Bantamweight Champion, fighting out of Spring, Texas, by way of Brooklyn, New York, she is Melissa La Bella Bestia Odessa Parker. And her opponent in the corner to my right, fighting out of the red corner. She stands at five feet, three and a half inches tall, wearing the black trunks with the gold trim. She weighed in at 119.8 pounds. She enters this fight with a record of 15 wins, four losses, and one draw. Nine of those wins by way of knockout. She is the IBF World Women's Bantamweight Champion, fighting out of San Juan, Argentina, by way of Via Malaya, Argentina. She is Cecilia Roman. Ladies and gentlemen, the following bout is set in the Bantamweight division with three five minute rounds of action. Introducing first, Fighting out of the blue corner, this combat Sambo style fighter stands at five feet, 11 inches tall. He weighed in at 134.6 pounds. He enters this fight with a professional record of one win and one loss and fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada by way of Havana, Cuba. He is Enzo, new religion. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This Muay Thai and BJJ specialist stands at five feet, eight inches tall. He weighed in at 135.8 pounds. He is making his professional debut and fighting out of Edmond, Oklahoma. He is Tony Clinton. Standing by with our roving reporter tonight, Blake Chadwick. Blake? Standing by here at XFC President Myron Malaki. Myron, it's a historic night here in Atlanta. With
with the relaunch of the XFC. You just came from the backstage area. You were talking to the fighters. Tell us what's going on in the locker room. Oops. The entire country is watching NBC Sports. What can everyone expect to see? Byron, any last words? Let's go. A historic night of fights are on the horizon. Kenny, back to you. All right.